Duh, there it is. Encanto! We we have definitely not seen we this. We have absolutely not seen the first two and a half minutes of this before internet issues sidelined us. Da 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 Disney intro! Beautiful cat. Have you been to Disneyland or uh, Disney World? I was at Disneyland when I was like five. I don't remember anything about it. Wow. I would really like to go. Same with like, I've never been to Legoland and that's like in Denmark. It's the happiest place on earth. I've always wanted to go to Legoland. But now I'm like, I'm too old, I'm sure. I'd be weird, like riding on yeah. all the kids' rides when I'm six foot four. I'd probably be put on a list. <laughs> You'd be red listed. <laughs> I would definitely want to go to like Universal Studio and Disneyland and. Uh, and uh, How did we get Potter a miracle? And stuff. That flame! I'm snuffing you out. She had three babies at the same time. She had three babies impressive. all at once. That's the real miracle here. That must be real heavy carrying three babies. Dark Souls, Bloodborne. The dangers. Here comes America. It's it's a uh, the Vandalin gang. <laughs> they made him disappear. Oh no. He materialized. Look, this is totally Dark Souls. It's the furtive pygmy. Wow. Wow. Okay, she calls this an Encanto. So I'm guessing Encanto is like... Miracle? An Encanto. I guess it's like a, a beautiful place. Or like a sanctuary. Hmm. The place where they call home. Magic builds the house. Watch your step. You're carrying three babies. Oh, it's like Smart House on uh, Disney. It, uh, that's a that's I a, well, that's I'm, a, I'm thinking of the, the like the house has a fucking life and that sounds it feels weird. Well, I mean, you have you have I have a Google device as my thermostat. I've got Google Nest, Google Home. My house might as well be that yeah. house. Definitely yes. Just, just uh, not open a beer. <laughs> hey Google, open a beer. I shouldn't have said that that it loud. My Google Home probably <laughs> it did hear me. She says something about 9 p.m. <laughs> it's all about family. This is really a story about family. But it's like helping him out. Here's your shoes. Ha! You're tiny. Not for long. Oh, it's oh, it's the variant door from Loki. Encanto. Oh my god. This is in the MCU multiverse. Apparently Lynn I don't know how much Lynn Manuel Miranda had to do with the soundtrack, but he did at least one song. I don't know uh, I don't know how many heat songs he ended up singing. Actually, oh, this is the part I've seen uh, on uh, Gunnel Ducks Christmas. This is the song. Is it the I've we know what the no no Bruno? No. That's uh, that's the one everyone's uh, memeing family about. Family Magical. Did it sound like this or was it like Donald Duck singing it? No, it's a magical! Swedish and I didn't hear that good because uh, a lot of like kids talking and my parents were talking and my sisters was like I didn't. Hear you should have been like, shut up! I'm doing research for the podcast. Are you ready? Sing it! Sing it! Hey. 
actually pretty catchy. Hello. The animation is so good. Hello. Thick queen. Coffee! Okay, so I do know that her family, everyone's magical, and she's not. And that's where the movie starts. Mm. And I guess she's going to end up finding out that the magic inside of her was the friend she made along the way. Yeah. I'm just going to say, that kid is a little bit... <laughs> I wouldn't expect that white of a kid to be living in oh, it's Colombia. Do- it's Donkey! <laughs> It was Donkey from Shrek. Oh, like it was in the background. I was busy making an odd reference or an odd observation. Bruno! We don't talk about Bruno. Yeah, we don't. I already know. I haven't even seen this, and I know we don't talk about Bruno. Huzzah! The animation is so good. It really is. Pixar is very good at making their movies. Is this Pixar? I thought it was just Disney. It's I think it's Pixar. That's the style of Pixar. Abuela. Let's see. Encanto, 2021 film. Yeah, I'm googling as well. I remember this one. No, stop talking about Bruno! Stupid kids. Um, It looks like it's just Disney. Oh, okay. Well, we don't much have the... But I mean, it, Disney Pixar style. It used to be Pixar did all the 3D stuff, and Disney did all the 2D stuff. But now everybody does 3D doesn't, animation. Doesn't Disney own Pixar? Yes. But Disney Pixar does their own movies, and I think Disney mostly does their yeah. distribution for like toys and stuff. Ah, uh, okay. That's why I don't know anything about Disney anymore. Are we gonna talk about how <laughs> that thick queen just? Moved a bridge. Yeah, that's pretty. It's like Animal Crossing. Hi. Yeah, what is your gift? Oh. She can play the. No accord- one oh knows my god! Doesn't have any power. <laughs> Tia Pepe. I actually quit my Spanish lesson I would, when I was in school. I would love to learn Spanish. I took two years of Spanish, but I don't remember any of it. Same. Oh, she was trying to set her sister up with that hunk. <laughs> <laughs> Stop singing! She, <laughs> she was so blunt she's like, like, with what that. The fuck. She's like, oh yeah, she did. She didn't get not. She got nothing. She didn't even like sugarcoat it. She's so special. <laughs> yes. Oh, I. Oh, how could I? She's not special. I'd be really sad all I need is family I already told you your gift are the friends you've made along the way I mean, she's got a magical house. I think that's gift enough. 
Yeah. Oh, Loki. I guess they need to make a staircase every time they need to go up. Yeah, why don't you just keep it there? Well, I guess you need, need room for activities. Hello. Oh! It's I. It's Ivy. Ow. The, ho <laughs> the house- the house- why didn't the house, like, dematerialize the beam? It's like, ha, ah, you have no gifts. Ooh, that nose. Ooh, that uh, hand. <laughs> oh. He was stung by a bee. I thought that was just him. Oh, sheesh. <laughs> Wasn't it just one hand one second ago? Do what? Wasn't it just one? Let's see. Oh, my God. Oh. Is that his gift? He can stop hives? He can change his appearance to be stinged or not stinged? <laughs> To sting or not to sting? That is the question. <laughs> Los musicals. Are the rooms bigger on the inside or the outside? <laughs> is, is it a TARDIS house? Oh no! Oh, yeah. Someone with gifts! Did you know that she does not have a gift? You're useless. <laughs> <laughs> you would think so, considering what everyone talks about. Oh! Even her abuela's like GTFO. Is Abuela, like, tough love? She knows that she has a gift, but she needs to tap into it, and so she's making <clears> her feel bad? She's gonna like, get super angry at one point, just unleash her power. Uh, Palpatine style. Even the power of the dark side. Has this? Has she ever heard of the story of Darth Plagueis? The wise? <laughs> <laughs> Is there an animal? Oh. Oh. Oh, it's a ch it's a child. <laughs> Never mind. I heard about monsters on the bed, but not children. Nine to nine monkeys jumping on the bed. What if he also doesn't have a gift? He could get. He could get X-ray vision. Just wait until the end of the movie. She'll have a door. Yeah. Then I'm gonna set up for a second movie. Encanto 2. Attack of the Clones. The house burns down. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that, that gift flaming goes out of control. It's her toenails. <laughs> her toenails. Remember me by this. Aww. Aww. Oh. The house is like, nope. You're f you're late. Hombrecito. I think that means little man. 
Damn. Fire! Oh, we got like shaky cam for a second, and it's an animated movie. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I thought that they built the house here to like protect themselves, but they invited like the whole world. They probably donkeys, donkey from Shrek. Wait, which dragon? Oh my god, a shapeshifter! Hopefully, they don't use that power for bad. They Is Walt Disney invited? <laughs> I mean, some people would say that he is, uh, like, cryogenically frozen somewhere, so... I guess he could be. Huh. Thick Queen. Activate. Oh, he's going after her! He wants him some Isa. Think of those people who are allergic to flowers. Yeah, they're just throwing them at everybody. Oh, Loki. Ha! Wait, so the house can read minds? Because it knew what they were doing. It knew that they were going to go hmm. up to that door. Unless they're just preventing anybody from going upstairs. Vamos, vamos, vamos. Now the light is going to go poof. Someone blows it out by accident. I mean, you say that, but that's probably about to happen when the villain shows up. <laughs> and earn a lot of money. Come together! Right now. Does everyone in the village been have been gifts? No, it's just a family. Because that would suck if you like I if guess. you were there living there and you're like, oh, here's this magical family and they get all the magic to themselves. That's probably what the villain's thinking. <laughs> I'm waiting for Di Vin Diesel to show up. <laughs> What's Vin Diesel going to do? <laughs> It's all about family. <laughs> isn't, it, isn't it Vin Diesel? Yeah. From uh, Fast and Furious. Yeah. yeah. Gonna get married. How dare you defile that child with your giftless hand. Even, even Abuela, like, hates her for not having magic. She's so like the middle child. Oh my god, if the if the stairs collapse because she's there with them, that'd be amazing. Okay, here's her gift ceremony. That went horribly wrong. I wonder what happened, like it pushed down the stairs. Antonio. I'm going to my doorway. Oh, it didn't open. It's going to do a fart and the sound and the glitter is going to go away. Oh, no. <laughs> the door went away. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to lie. That would traumatize me. Oh, no. Let me guess. Let me guess, she is adopted. <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe. Oh my god, watch, the, the door's gonna vanish again. They probably put their souls into that candle. Why do they need the, the people? The candle makes the house alive. Why do they need the people to help protect the house? Or keep the house alive? No idea.
He's gonna turn into animals. Oh my, is that like his familiar? Do they get like an animal familiar? Mm. I would want a macaw. It's a Pokemon. He can talk to animals. Oh, it's Dr. Doolittle! On the surface, that seems like an amazing power, but like that would be very boring after a while, because like you would talk to dogs and they'd be like, food, 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 hungry. Oh, I'm, oh. I'm thinking of uh, <clears throat> that episode of uh, Rick and Morty when uh, Jerry was talking to a cat and you just have to deal with it that that is the talking cat. There's a capybara. Yeah, I think talking to animals, it'd be cool for like a second and then you realize what animals really would say. <laughs> it'd be like, okay, I'm done. Uh, okay, this bigger on the inside. No, it's a tart. Look at that TARDIS. That's what they said. That's what I'm you said. They're, ti I'm, they're, they're time lords. <laughs> You're a little Colombian child and you didn't even know it. That tiger would definitely kill him. Well, no, but it can... Well, it didn't talk to him. Can he talk to animals or does he control animals? Talk to animals. Well, yeah, but he didn't talk to the leopard. It just came and took him. Like, it didn't know. I guess it's just, oh, you, you understand us. Yay, I'm so happy. I'm gonna eat you later. <laughs> I like my prey happy first. Whee! Water! Uh, yeah, I would not be happy around an animal like that. Is there anyone that gets a gift and they're like, this gift sucks? <laughs> Who's that one <laughs> woman with, like, that rain cloud following around her? That can't be fun. All of them, all the rest of the family are gonna gather, but not her. Because she's, she's a special. Get out of here, Maribel! Even... Oh. oh, look, they didn't even... Oh, what... Rip. Those, that's a horrible family. <laughs> they didn't even include her in the family picture. This family's awful. I wish their powers were gone. I'm guessing... He's, like, under... Like, I know they're trying she to make has it... like, a... Depression. I know they're trying to make it, like, incidental. Like, oh, well, they're just... They just happen to not be thinking about her. But, like, they're really making them not the most sympathetic family. Because they don't even, like... Yeah. Even the grandma doesn't like her. Yeah, she's, she, she so has depression. How fun would that power be? Controlling rain and her rain and hurricane and suns. Well, the only time we've seen it, it's been like contained to like her being like a rain cloud over her head. But like, if she could control like the weather of an entire continent, that'd be one hell of a power. Like, I'd become like a super villain. Like, you pay me, and like I can <laughs> retire early, or I'll like flood you. I would totally use my gift for bad. <laughs> Well, I would use it for monetary gain, I would say. I'm gonna make it rain for one whole year. Like, if the price is right, I'll do good. <laughs> if the price is right, I'll also do bad. <laughs> it depends. My gift would be for sale. She's probably evil. That'd be cool if she, like, became the villain. That's why the candle rejects her. Oh, this is her I Want song. And the Disney canon, every Disney song, every Disney movie has an I Want song. Yeah. Oh, yeah, but by the way, did I say I, did I, say I hate uh, musicals? Do I hate what? Did, did I say to you that I hate musicals? 
Uh, no, but I know a lot of people who don't. Yeah, uh, I absolutely hate musicals. Oh, why are we watching Encanto? <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. I was, gonna I was say, interested in it. I mean, this is a Disney movie. It, it is a, it definitely is going to be a musical. I like musicals, though, mm-hmm. so. I know a lot of people don't care for uh, it, though. You know, I just noticed uh, she got a cut and it was blood. Well, we know self-healing ability is oh, not her right. gift. Now, where is this coming from? Oh, it's the Hunk Man! It's his fault. He's evil! Is it a Dalek? I would definitely get, get out. You know what would help? Going deeper into the house that's about to collapse. No! I'd be like, fuck that candle. It didn't do anything for me. It's kind of strange how, like, the cracks go up to the candle, so not from the candle. Yeah, well, I'm guessing it's like an evil force that's trying to get at the candle. And nobody cares. Hmm. Look at that kid! He's got moves! <laughs> Even grandma got moves. Oh, I thought she was going to be. Uh, oh. Uh oh. It was a vision. Oh, adult joke. I mean, that could be a kid joke if they're serving, like, apple juice. Hmm. I'm still strange that, like, they don't have any, any, like... Oh. Are you sure you're okay? Could have been a vision or something? They don't... Should we be worried a little bit? <laughs> she has no gift. They don't care. <laughs> Is that her gift? Like, she can see the worst in everything? Like, she has... Or I'm guessing it's, like, premonition or something. Maybe. Didn't she have a cut on her hand? Oh, she... Maybe she oh. still does. Oh, not... Oh, that was food. I think she said in her song that her mom had the power to heal people. Oh. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Aha! Arifa con queso. Maybe her mom is the only one who loves her. Mama. Don't talk about Bruno. This is like the whole family are like naysayers to science, and then she's like the climatologist who's like, climate change is real, and everyone's like, no, go back to drinks. Why do you care about the flame? It did nothing for you. I'd be like, screw the flame. He's going to take it. Eat it. I must protect the flame. Dear flame. Maybe it gave her the gift of uh, acrobatics. <laughs> imagine what she. Imagine seeing her grandma just do random shit in her room. Well, oh my god. Oh! Tension. She's right there.
Hmm. It's time. To, it's time to tell them that the pow our powers of the Force have diminished. Only the Dark Lord of the Sith knows of our weakness. Because it's a movie. It's To be fair, had Pedro been here, if he were still alive and not killed by rampant Americans, uh, you wouldn't have the house to begin with, so. <laughs> Steal it. Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> I wasn't being serious. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Dude, that's another gift you could do so much evil with. Supersonic hearing. <laughs> Is that why she has big ears? Did it? Is that how it gave her? Why didn't it just like improve her hearing? It had to give her big ears too. I'd be like, come on now. Oh. Oh. That would suck. Is that her no soon that fucking peep sound? I do not know. I I do know there's thick queen again. We want breakfast. Capybara! You want breakfast? <laughs> you sounded evil. You want breakfast? Damn, she's, uh, harsh. Oh, boy. Oh! Look, they're using their powers Damn. for... She just talked about, oh, we need to be responsible. And then she's also like, oh, well, we need to use the powers for evil. And also that she needs to shove five babies through her body. Well, we need to expand a family somehow. We need more magic! Oh, snap. Louisa knows what... Yeah, get out of here. You ran into her! Oh, my God. I'm moving to church. One meter to the left. <laughs> the priest was like, glory to God, and this thick woman. There's Donkey. I'm taking, I'm taking you back to Shrek. Dude, we really need a Shrek Disney crossover. I got a lot of donkeys yeah. in my back. <laughs> what kind of gift is that? We're going to give you the gift of chores. <laughs> How many fucking donkeys oh my God. is there? There's another one. How many Shrek movies is there? <laughs> I think there's I think there's four of them. Okay. He's holding four donkeys. I mean technically there's five counting in Canto. Oh, I heard a beat and I was like, are they starting a song? And then it stopped and then it started again. <laughs> I'm guessing the donkeys, <laughs> like, they got, they realized that she was willing to carry them, and then they just stopped moving themselves, and they were like, okay, you could just keep carrying us. Well, oh, damn. Freaking out a little bit. Those poor donkeys. Oh, that's another Disney movie. 
Mm. We oh my gosh, change your music styles. <laughs> It's a lot of donkeys. That's weird. See, that's what I'm saying. Some of these people have sucky gifts. Yeah. They gave they the candle gave her the power to be taken advantage of. Titanic. I was like, did I did I say Titanic? But I think it said Magical. Yeah. <laughs> and then they had the donkeys playing the music. And it's switching music styles. Whee! This looks like the imagination room uh, from <laughs> Steven the Universe. What the hell? <laughs> they look high. They're kind of setting it up that the candle is like a nefarious thing. And I wonder if they're going to yeah. actually play with that. I think the music is the enemy here. <laughs> is that because you don't like musicals? Yeah. <laughs> the See, her powers acted up while she was singing, so... Oh my god, she is thick. Wait until you watch Hamilton. That's like 98% evil. <laughs> if if your logic is sound. That's like 98% music and then evil. I like how in musicals, especially Disney and Pixar stuff, uh, all that singing was nothing and nothing happened. He just stood there. That's what we call non-diegetic, by the way. So stupid. See, like the whole I town. Get the donkeys. The whole town takes advantage of her. Hey, she had a terrible vision about it. Bruno has a wait. Find the vision. Well, yeah. Yes, dark magic. Even the nature of the dark side. We don't talk about Bruno. I mean, they say that, but we've talked about Bruno quite a bit. You should see some of my You're Facebook next. meme groups. All they do is talk about Bruno. Oh, he's a time traveler? Oh, hell no. Oh, is the house called Louisa? <laughs> the house is a dead person. <laughs> oh, the sand. Anakin wouldn't like that. I don't like sand. It's coarse and irritating. Oh, and the face. Oh, it's Dune! Ugh. He's got to save the spice. The spice must flow! Oh, that's big. That is like Dark Souls 2. Oh, I saw this on the trailer teaser.
You need to pace yourself, girl. Okay, that's, elevator. That's why we don't talk about Bruno. He has an obsession with stairs. Uh-oh. <laughs> Where did she get the rope? It was that thing on the the railing. Oh. Look, it's her gift. She doesn't need a gift and she has gifts. I would like to see Isabella do any of that crap. She'd be like, I'm <laughs> too pretty to do this. I need to have my five you children. Need to like the bird was like, you, you could definitely die there. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> I don't think her mom can resurrect people from the dead. <laughs> <laughs> they turn into house. Houses. Ooh. Ugh. And that's like Indiana Jones. Ew! <laughs> I'm scared. Bird. Bye. I quit her. <laughs> uh, to be fair, I already eat it out of there too. I'm like, fuck this. Fuck this shit, I'm out. No, oh, no. Commercial break. <laughs> Oh, it's green. Green is the evil. <laughs> oh, is it Bruno? Is this, the... <laughs> is this the, the the drug in Dune? Oh, the melange spice? Uh, maybe. How do you hurt magic? Oh, look! Your giftless granddaughter was right all along. Oh, she's not supposed to put it back together. No, 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 don't do it. No. Uh-oh. Do it. Do it. Run, Indy. Throw me the stone and I'll throw you the rope. Is her gift just going to be that she no longer has to wear glasses? At the end of the movie? She's going to be blind. That would be some sick uh, irony by the magic. Oh, she's going to be buried alive. Oh, that's right. There's a handle. Rip. Bell. Is that one of the... You know those uh, plates you could buy that had uranium in it? Uh, Yes. That's those, those. Those, those do, it does look like uranium. This is your fault somehow. <laughs> All they care about is getting their daughter full of babies. Good God. <laughs> this family is really evil. This family is awful. <laughs> I'd rather have uh, the family in Fast and Furious. Oh, 
<laughs> it just follows her around like a dog. <laughs> she looks tired. That's probably why she looks tired. <laughs> She's mentally exhausted all the time. I even knew that. <laughs> I would lose scared her actually. Oh, is it that song now? <laughs> Yay. They're, 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 they've memed this before. I like how they, like the main characters, like dancing in the flashback. Yeah, I like how they're using the the uh, songs to like do flashbacks and tell the lore and characterization and stuff. It's not like Dumbo, where they spent like twenty minutes on a song that was hmm. just Dumbo getting high. Oh wait, dude, dude, look, look up at the the second floor. Yeah, he was like the G-Man from Half-Life. He, he's standing right there. What the fuck? He's he's beating. He's popping too. Mr. Freeman, Bruno. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna call it right now. Bruno's not a bad guy. Yeah, it kind of feels like that. People uh, have misunderstood him, but he's not actually evil. <laughs> what the? Uh. Oh my god, she's going to get pregnant so fast. Mean. Everybody's mean. Here we go. Everything's gonna fall apart. Yeah, world is fucked. You know what? This family, honestly, they could use some humbleness. I think they would need family therapy. They would be they they would be good to have a day or two without magic. Cause yeah. magic has turned them into not good people. <laughs> <laughs> the house was trying to help her move it out of the way. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's he's gonna have a heart attack. Oh. 
miércoles. They're eating soup. Are we just, everyone's just gonna pretend like he's not about to pump five babies into her uterus? <laughs> Look at those two just staring at each other. Don't! Don't! <laughs> don't! I'm gonna f fuck you up. Don't! Oh! Uh! Uh oh! <laughs> mm. Everyone's gonna know. Uh oh. Wow, guess who's next? <laughs> oh shit. No. Oh god. No. <laughs> oh, poor Louisa. What the heck? They're helping. Why are they doing that? There goes the house. Oh, that person shape shifted into a baby. Now they're going to kick her out. Those damn rats. Rats. Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? Are we gonna kill you? Yeah, they could use a day or two without magic. It's made them horrible people. <laughs> A house full of magical people and no one noticed this. <laughs> Do they not clean? <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe I guess maybe the house cleans itself. That's how lazy they are. Oh my god, is 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 this Bruno? Does he live in the house? <laughs> he lives in the walls. It's like Gary Buse. Uh, oh! He's like Gary Busey living in the walls. That's bloody spooky. Damn, did he knows parkour. Okay, I do love how this is a, this is an action not an action. This is an adventure movie, but it all takes place in one house. That's actually pretty <laughs> cool. Like we've we've gone nowhere but the house so far. I guess maybe the filmmakers, they were thinking, because this was produced during COVID, like when no one could leave their house. So I guess maybe that was the inspiration. Uh, Here we go! Oh, I thought she was going to jump parkour. across. Bruno! <clears throat> That's pretty deep. 
Yeah, where does that go? Is that house built on the whole of the earth? It's going straight down to the core. Yeah, now they're double fucked. <laughs> oh, well, there you go. Oh, no, okay. <laughs> That's right, it is a house. <laughs> that, was, that was so funny. To be fair, if I was holding someone up and a rat showed up, I would let them go too. <laughs> Same. See, I told you Bruno's not. <laughs> I told. <laughs> I told you Bruno wasn't going to be evil. He's just misunderstood. Oh, he's got. Uh... Oh. <clears throat> no, look at the rat just chilling. <laughs> yes, at least they're cleaning in themselves. I wonder if they set that up earlier in the film that like food was missing. Probably not, because everyone's got. <laughs> Everyone's too full of themselves and their magic. It's because he's been protecting the family. Or maybe he's a creeper and he's just staring at everybody. Yeah. Aww. Aww. Bruno. I told you, this family's awful! Very good, like, deciphering between how the family sees him and how he really is like creepy and evil like he's like here yes. all dumb and they totally friendly. set him up to be evil <laughs> but I, I guess at the same time they they did it they exaggerated so much I was like you know what maybe he's not good well then they also haven't shown him at all until now so He was the only family member who cared about her. Yeah. Knowing what I know about the family, I probably would have left too. I would be like, there's no explaining it to these people. Oh, notice that her eyeglasses, they've been green this whole movie, and it's the same color as that vision block. Hmm.
Damn! I was curious, because <laughs> I didn't know if Bruno controlled rats or if that kid controlled rats. <laughs> rats are just friendly, apparently. That's See? <laughs> <laughs> I like the rats. I wish I liked rats in real life, because rats are actually pretty cool creatures. Fuck the family, they suck! <laughs> I'll go to my grave saying that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the grandma would sell her daughter off to some American imperialists in order to save her home. <laughs> Hmm. Oh, weird. Mmm, <clears throat> salt. There's a lot of Star Wars references in this. I love the capybaras. I have my bigger tiger. <laughs> that capybara had no fucks to give. Smells like Bruno. Unlimited power. He's too dangerous to keep alive. It's a butterfly. Yes. Grandma. Grandma. What? That's never gonna happen. <laughs> what? Plot twist, Batman. The fuck? That was kind of a letdown. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was, that was funny. Oh, 
go. A hug. A hug. <laughs> This house is very petty. Definitely. Clean the clean the house once in a while. Take all the pictures down. Hmm. Knock on wood. Good luck. This is <laughs> knock, knock, knock. Good call, fusion. Wee. You know Bruno better than Bruno knows himself. And that's only why he's knocking on wood, because I don't see the danger. <clears throat> he also throws salt over his shoulder, which is another don't let things bad happen to me thing. We haven't seen we haven't seen any black cats yet. Dude he'd be he'd be flipping out if Antonio had like a black cat come through. How can she fucking live there? That's the Paulan Inferno. They're also standing on flowers. No shit. A hug. A song. I sense a song coming on too, yes. She was about to have five babies up in her uterus. Hug. Uh, okay, if that man really loved you, he would propose to you anyway. I like crepes. Well, here we go. This is interesting, because I watched Raya and the Last Dragon, and that movie did not have an antagonist. And this movie also does not have an antagonist. She is an antagonist. Well, That's I mean... Name is. Technic I guess so. But, I mean, there's not, like, a major villain bad guy. Uh, oh, what the fuck? A cactus? Oh, it's like a pimple. Wait, what did she confess? Here you go, Fusion. This is the time I'm turning off the audio. <laughs> <laughs> oh, every, her room is good. She's going to make a cactus room now. I like the flowers better than. Wee. I would like her future husband. Uh, that's gonna pop five babies into her uterus. Gonna <laughs> like cactus. <laughs> ah! Hologram. Oh, it's like that wall on the the new TARDIS. Man, that would be an interesting bed to make babies on. <laughs> I'm just saying. I would get. I think we get quite seasick. That probably. Damn it, woman! Give me a hug. Is it? Is she gonna grow weed? Uh, weed. Dude, that'd be uh, okay. You know what? <laughs> She she probably has the potential to have make the most money off of her power. <laughs> Cause she can grow weed, but if so anyone comes to investigate her, she can just make it go away. I should point out that if you have 
If, if you have two family members, if, if you and a family member are having difficulties, singing a song probably won't help that. I just want to point that out. Yeah. But, like, all they had to do to save her, to salvage, like, years of emotional abuse was to sing a song. But I don't think that works in real life. Uh oh. More donkeys! She hurt his nose. Oh, it's like Jawali. <clears throat> I'm in Kala Festival, like they have in India. Oh! 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 They did it! Is the movie over? It's getting close. Nope, it's only we have an 45 hour and minutes more. Or 40 minutes more. A, a lot of it is credits. True. Dude, her sister looks better looking half goth. Okay, you know what? I guess Grandma's the antagonist. Fine, I'm leaving. I'd, I'd leave too. I'd be like, fuck you, Grandma. <laughs> they were so close, too. Oh my god, is this going to end on a cliffhanger? Will there be an Encanto 2? Yeah, how would they fix this in 20 minutes? Tell her! Suck on that, Grandma. Good, I hope the house burns down. Ah, uh, weak. Oh, I like how the house is weak, so it has to get resourceful. It didn't, like, build her a ladder, it just, like... Reconstructed hmm. something it already had. That's pretty cool. Oh, never mind. It's still magical. <laughs> Parkour this bitch! Oh, that was in the vision. See, the house knows what's up. It's helping her out. Oh. This is Indiana Jones. I am. The house is cool. Oh, shit. Bye. 
But why would they, if if it if life left the house, why would they fall away like that? They would have stayed where they were. Why are you going? Go and hug your sister. That... Good job. Did Dick Grandma even have any powers herself? You know what? Now that you mention it, she did seem more like a Nick Fury. <laughs> she organized all the magic people, but she wasn't magic herself. Yeah. Is this really going to end on a cliffhanger? This is strange. Oh, you know what? No, we've got plenty of time left. There's like 20 minutes. Search for 20 days, nothing happened. Everyone in the, else is in the city moved out. Yeah, now everybody cares about Mirabelle. But <laughs> I'm actually holding up to her ear, but that you can't hear better. Oh, that's a good point. You're right. She doesn't have magic anymore. Welcome to the family, magical. We don't have any power. Remember, it's magical. Remember when this movie was happy? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think they changed the like the gray tone a little bit as well, so it's more uh, white than yellow. You know what, kid? I'm a piece of shit. <laughs> I so wish she would admit that, but she's probably not going to. <laughs> oh, that's the place where he died. This river is where the Americans came and killed my husband. Americans never invaded Colombia, so I don't know who the invaders were. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like Isabella, she actually did have plenty of children come out of her uterus. <laughs> Don't it's the butterfly. Butterfly effect. Oh, I wonder if that's why it is a butterfly. There's a candle. There's another candle. It's a lot of candles. It's a boy! Three it's three! Babies? It's a lot less Dark souls -y now. Why, uh... It's the Vaqueros! So the ultimate purpose of this... Did they just this... flee... Go Did ahead. they flee, like, like two, 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 like, miles or something? It feels like they didn't go that far. Yeah, they far. didn't go that far, really. <laughs> I guess the whole point of this film is don't have kids, because the world's fucked up, and they're going to be born in a horrible world <laughs> where your dad dies in front of your eyes. That's don't the point of the movie. get killed by mystery American people. <laughs> Because then your family will get magical powers, and one daughter. No, and Americans. Later on in the family is gonna fuck it all up. Americans wouldn't have machetes; they'd have guns. I feel like this song doesn't really match as well. Feels a bit too happy. It fit the mood up until the murder started. <laughs> Yeah, remember when you were a human, Grum? Oh, that's the villagers. It's that group of people that stayed. 
I thought they were inviting people to, like, their little commune. Oh, that's why she was able to leave in the first place, because that crack opened up in the mountains. Oh, so they literally can't move. They can't mm. leave that place. <clears throat> So Which they have like a the crack again. This movie is basically about a cult commune compound <laughs> oh, where God. no one can leave. No, the more, me, senpai. <laughs> the more we explore this world, the more we build the world, the more worse it seems. Yeah. You should watch more Disney movies. <laughs> oh my God! Yeah, this is this is terrible. They can never leave. What's the world like in Sweden? I don't know. We can't leave here. <laughs> we have no internet. Rip. There's a butterfly. Eat the butterfly. Ah, oh, there's the vision. They needed to embrace. Is she gonna, is she gonna fucking drought her? <laughs> it's, uh, have you played Bioshock Infinite all the way through? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Too, too this many is times. Go it's gonna be the end of Bioshock Infinite. <laughs> There's always a lighthouse. <laughs> There's always a grandma. Always a magical building. Drowner! What? Yo, let's let's turn the the color sliders up. So the problem was that the grandma needed to realize that what her name is is a person. That's what it seems like. Uh, I think she actually is adopted. This movie is about realizing that we're family, no matter what. Even if grandma is evil, and your they granddaughters... They really need Vin Diesel right now. Oh, Roald El Dorado! Good job! Mirabel. Hug it out. Now hug it out. Now hug it out. <laughs> there we go what again. His ear, like, flapping like that? That must have been a hell of a time to animate. Yeah. We'll build a new house. No, they need to have an easy way out. Dude, Isabella looks way better half goth. <laughs> oh, it's now they're actually gonna relax it on Oh, we can't live without powers. No, you can't <laughs> The thing is they don't know how to live by themselves, so they're gonna be pretty fucked either way. I I think 
if you lived your whole life with magical powers and you suddenly lost them, I think it would be a lot more difficult of a time than, oh, well, we're good, okay. I think you would have a lot more, yeah. like, you would need a lot more time to cope with that. Everyone seems kind of fine Just with wait, it. Gonna... Just wait, they're going to build a house that's like, oh, poof, the candle's going to light up or something. Just hug everybody. Eventually, you'll hug the right person. <laughs> you'll get your magic back. <laughs> Oh, okay, I see. I see the meaning of this. Everyone is a miracle. The miracle was not the magic. The miracle was the fact that they have each other. And that Bruno can get down like a boss. I mean, look at his moves. Also, no one's like... Troubled by the fact that Bruno was like living in their house for ten years. Uh. Yeah, coffee's not good for him. But she still has muscles. Yeah, what are those muscles even doing? She should be able to lift more. Oh, well, she did lift that rock a few minutes ago. Somewhat. Hmm. They're going through all this time and trouble just for a cholera epidemic to kill most of them. <laughs> Ew. What? <laughs> what? Why doesn't he like uh, Isabella? What a player. What? What? <laughs> oh, Isabella didn't want to marry. What? Wait, I thought she wanted to marry him. I don't know. Yeah, we were we were making fun and talking during that song. She probably explained why she didn't really want to marry him. Whenever I do these commentaries, if there's little things like that that I think I missed, I just chalk it down to I was probably talking and I missed the explanation. <laughs> Dude, Antonio's hair looks wonderful, by the way. Everyone's hair looks amazing in 3D animation. Mm, yeah. This movie is about how people can change in an instant. And how people never take years to change for the better. Just give them their magic back. It's either that or they don't get their power back. It's either, is there going to be a second movie or not? Let's find out. In Canto 2, the search for more magic. Yep, there it is. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, we now we'll have to learn lessons again. Now they can basically just throw her out again and hate her. I know. In ten years, we're gonna have the sequel because everyone's gonna be like, "Oh, you suck, Mirabelle." Oh, she's gonna do the same thing with her daughter. Oh, in Canto Two, the next generation. Uh, okay. Uh, consent house. That's a thing. Whoa! Oh, is she gonna get her room?
Jawali! Relax. Oh! Is it raining M&M's? It didn't look like rain. And she still has no power. Oh, look, she's in the family photo now. Hey, but she has no power. Me and Kanto! Huh. Hello, Clarice. That was interesting. Well, Fusion, how did you like the movie? If I would give it a score to like 1 to 10. Mm, I think I would give it like a 6 out of 10. Uh, That's pretty generous of me because it's a Disney movie <laughs> and I don't like Disney movies. <laughs> Weren't you the one who asked me if I wanted to watch this in the first place? Well, it's... It's all about the memes. I want to see why it's a thing. That is a that is, I I have zero interest to watch the book of Boba Fett, but once the memes start flowing in, I'll probably be a lot more interested. Yeah, I um speaking of Boba Fett, I'm on I've seen the third episode and I'm like mm, it's okay. It's yeah, I wouldn't I would watch it one but one time, but I wouldn't watch it a second time. It didn't seem like anything I needed to rush to see. But yeah, yeah. I would. I'd give this maybe a seven. Seven out of ten. It was fun. The colors were nice. But I mean, yeah, I didn't. I animation didn't. Animation and everything like that. It was difficult for me to feel invested in anything. One because the family was awful, <laughs> and two because there was no <laughs> bad guy. So like, there's no danger really. Like they were their own danger. I'm, I'm, they just needed to learn. Oh well, don't be awful people. It's that's kind of the hard thing here, trying to find them like the moral cake cake in this. Yeah, what there's is, what, what 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 are we supposed to get out of this? Well, I mean, it's a it's definitely a film about family. Life. It's about family, like Fast and the Furious is about family. Yeah, Vin Diesel approves. But I think yeah, it would be. I think I it might hit differently if like. If you're a family with like a b black sheep in the family, I mean, I'm sort of the black sheep yeah. of the family, but like at the same time, I've never felt like my family hated me and didn't want me. Etchy. Yeah. I, yeah, I, I need to reflect on what, what I need to take this out of this movie. Yo! To, to real life, because that's that's kind of a uh, what like kids movies does. Like, oh, you're supposed to reflect on. Oh, this is how I could be better myself in real life. Does that mean we're going to be watching it again? Oh no, I don't fucking. I'm not watching this movie <laughs> again. <laughs> I'm moving on to something else. But it, yeah, animation is beautiful. Gra voice acting is very good. Music is is is, is, is it's music. I lo I lo if, if I would say my favorite song, it would be the We Don't Talk About Bruno. Um, I like the, the uh, I Am, that first song that you that you heard Donald Duck sing. I Am Family Magical. Uh, I like that one. Yeah, I, I, the I Bruno, like the, the... The Bruno song was good too, though. Uh, it's like how the style of it... Oh, and I like the yeah. Louisa song when she was singing about... Uh, I like the imagery with like the donkeys falling out of the sky. That was fun. I had that, I, I liked how that was uh, actually pretty interesting with the music style because it kind of like changed between like three themes, like kind of a rocky kind of thing, yeah. then to a pop, then to a, like a slow one. That's like okay, interesting. I've never seen this in a movie before. They were very, uh, I guess, eclectic with their musical tones. Yeah, they weren't afraid well, to. They did swap it up. Uh, Disney made something that they definitely have profit out of, so good for them. That's what I've I've always, been, little, uh, I've always been curious because this did get released in theaters, and they didn't make a lot of money at the theaters, but they made money out of Disney Plus subscriptions. And I've always been mm -hmm. curious, like how Netflix and Disney Plus, how they can, how they can figure, like, oh well, we made this much profit off of a film just by posting it on Netflix. And I, I don't even... I don't know how that um, works, really. 
like how you make money. I, I mean, know. I know they can, make money you, from subscriptions, but can you can you hire movies through Disney Plus? Can, can I what do Disney Plus? Hire movies like borrow. I. Oh, I think. Oh, yeah. I think when movies come out, when Black Widow was released in theaters, you could pay an extra fee to watch it on Disney Plus. Maybe people do that, and then oh, families like oh, well, yeah, but need they to subscribe to. But they stopped doing that though. Disney Plus, so I can watch it. Because they got sued oh. by Scarlett Johansson. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good for Disney. But yeah, I am curious about how people like how they figure like how they make a profit when they spend millions of dollars on these films. I mean, I know they make a lot of money on subscriptions, but still, I would assume that that's not enough to constitute it. So I'm assuming there's money being made elsewhere. I don't know. Mm. Uh, I did a little quick Google of what Disney movies are coming out next. Um, apparently the. It is Ice Age, which I don't know how they can still make tons oh of Oh boy, games. I didn't watch uh, the first something one. called. Yeah, I've seen it when I was a kid. But I don't like it. Uh, Turning Red. Uh, oh oh oh! I I am legit. I legitimately want to watch that one. That one looks fun. Should we do? Should we do that as well? Yeah. It comes out in March. Yeah, we can watch that. That's about a uh, a young a girl who uh, she's growing up and she. It's a, she's there's a family curse where she turns into a giant red panda. It looks absolutely hilarious and fun. Okay, so we have a it's a crossover of uh, panda movie and uh, and Naruto. What the fuck is called? That one might hit a little bit more differently than this because this is all about family, and I've never had like my family was always kind of like emotionally not familial all that much <laughs> like we're mostly just friends not so much family but i did have a rough go of things mm. when i was growing up like through puberty and stuff so i think that movie might, might hit me differently than encanto i don't know it's, this one is that one is made by pixar i believe so yes yeah that's gonna be interesting it's gonna be fun i would i would definitely be up for watching it Ahsoka? Oh, Ashoka. Ah ah Ahsoka. Ah it's, an it's another Disney uh, Star Wars reference. Yeah. All right. Well, I guess we're going to be signing off here for the podcast. Thank you guys for watching uh, Fusion Fall. Thank you for hanging out and watching Encanto. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's very interesting and fun. First Disney movie in 10 years. Yay. Maybe next time we'll watch a Disney movie in 2D animation. Which will probably never happen again. Yeah. They don't make 2D anymore. It's old school. <laughs> Sadly. Some studios yeah. make 2D animation, just not Disney. Disney's done with that. Now now all of their movies look exactly the same. Yeah. You should watch an old classic cartoon movie like Help, I'm a Fish or something. A Bug's Life, Hercules... Hunchback of Notre Dame. Heck, I'd even go back and watch. Well, I probably wouldn't watch Fox and the Hound because that would probably hit too hard at the moment. <laughs> but like right. uh, Snow White and all those. Quite, quite many of those you just said I like never seen. Snow Snow White might actually be legitimately like scary now that I'm old enough to understand what I'm watching. Like like Pinocchio came out in, like the 20s and that is like there's some scenes in Pinocchio that are legitimately like horrifying <laughs> it was a whole different Disney it was a whole different Disney <laughs> <laughs>